Hey guys, this is Puerto Rican 88 here. I got a request from Trains Fans for Life. I guess the uh, Trains Fans. Not to worry, I'm not saying anything offensive. Um, I got a request from you how to how to make the lights. Well, he replied to me, uh, sending me a message about ditch lights, as in to make the lights flash. So, uh, let's get started. But, to let you know, this involves on updating one of your trains that will corrupt the running numbers and the door sounds. If uh, one of the trains has that. Alright. Let's get started. Now, to make your lights flash, you'll have to go into effects, where corona means lights, like headlights. Or rear lights. Okay. Now you see, just go in here, effects, just to repeat. And it's from one, two, four, five. The, the corona means those are headlights and rear lights. Like for instance, the red corona, that's the rear light. And if, if it's either white corona or some other colored corona, that's the headlight. Now, to change, of course, go into here where you go into Code Browser. Now, select Texture. Now, you see all your Coronas there that you want to select. Either white, red, or green, the ones that you downloaded. Well, I would suggest um, the Glow Coronas, because probably that might work if you do it in Glow. So uh, select one of those. The one I selected was orange. That is like, uh, I don't know if you see those on one of the trains, but anyway. Okay, after you select your Corona. Now, in order to make the, the flash work, even though it says glow, go into the one of the numbers, and you see where right click. Now, all you gotta add is just two things. One is frequency and two directional once those are added you can uh, change the speed of the the lights flashing either fast or slow like for instance if I were to set it to 10 or more the lights will flash quicker but if I set it in a lower number the lights will flash slower as in dimmer and brighter directional I'm not sure what this is but I guess it might be like the, uh, I guess the, the siren type lights. But I'm not sure. But anyway, give this a try to see what the effects will do. Yeah, because I try to see what the heck that does. But if it has to do with the frequency of the speed of the light splashing or the uh, directional. But anyway, give that a try. Okay, after you're done adding the frequency and directional, now to repeat this, I meant, I'll just repeat it again. You right click and you should see where it says add frequency and add directional. Add those two and the lights will start flashing. After you're done adding, you can set the speed by using frequency. The higher the number, the, the faster it gets by flashing. If you set it in a very low number, the lights will flash slower. Directional, like I said, I'm not sure, but give this a try to see what the effects will do. Because you know, that I'm still trying to figure it out. On red corona, it would work the same way unless you find the red corona glow. So in other words, the, um, you could do the same thing with the red corona on the rear lights. I don't know if that will um, place it on the rear lights, but try that to see if that will work. Because I know on the, uh, the headlights will work, but I don't know if the rear lights would do. But give that a try and, and uh, use Red Corona. And remember, add frequency right here. Add frequency first and directional. And then you can set it to whatever number. The higher the number, the lights will, go, will flash faster. The lower the number, then it will flash slower. But 
For this, it involves, like I said, I'll repeat this again. It involves updating the trains into a different version, the higher version, which corrupts the running numbers and the, uh, the door sound if one of the trains has that. But in other words, but I'll try to figure a way how to do it without using the Content Creator Plus to see how that works. And I'll keep you guys updated on that. And um, hope this helps for uh, Trains Fans for Life, because I can see you're a Trains Fan. So, that's my tutorial for today, and I uh, hope this helps you. And for the other train users out there that want to have their lights flashing, well, do this and read the instructions. Adios.